Do you ever lie to these people on tours? Oh, I from- would I would like create a whole false uh, identity for myself. Wow. I had one of my things I was doing was I was wearing a fake wedding ring uh, it was like an engagement ring that my mom had was like a piece of costume jewelry and i'd be like i just can't wait for my christmas wedding and i would talk about my boyfriend <laughs> yeah <laughs> that didn't exist. just playing a role for no reason yeah just to make uh. it keep it interesting because then it would make me focus because i have to remember like what i said and what i did it i had a whole thing and then i was kind of experimenting if saying i was pregnant if i would get more tips that way being like i hope i'm not starting to show early on yeah. Wow. Yeah. Bert would do this thing when he would do the uh, when he was doing club still, um, um, before he discovered Instagram, um, that he would do a like you know check drop spots come so he'd be like mm-hmm. hey and he'd do this raffle of like giving something away and he would give all the extra tips to one waitress. Oh, yeah. that's and awesome. Then he would bring that waitress on stage like hey all your extra tips are going to this to whatever I don't know how he do the extra that's whatever. That's so cool. But he would instruct them to like what are you gonna do with with this extra tip money if 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 you get it or whatever. Mm-hmm. And um, I think like he would go an extra ten minutes. He goes, everybody's got to throw in an extra two dollars. We're doing this, and one waitress gets it. And he would instruct him not to say like put it in the bank because nobody wants to get behind that. Mm-hmm. He'd say say something like a legit dream that they can get behind. Like one of them would go, like, "I'll take my mom to the movies or oh, my daughter to the yes. movies." And people are like, Sw- "Oh yeah, here, here." Yes, but they wouldn't even have a daughter, <laughs> you know, <laughs> or a mom, and it'd just be like, "Just yeah. say it." Yeah, yeah, I would. I think that that's so much more fun because it's like no one wants to hear like I'm a comedian. This is my day job, and I'd really rather be doing something else. <laughs> Trying to get by. Please yeah, me. yeah, yeah. Oh, it's so fun to just create a, a narrative. Oh, it's so fun. And I was kind of doing a thing because Mike and I had started dating. So right after that point, I was like, wouldn't it be funny if I'm a tour guide and like my boyfriend's in the mafia, but I don't know. And I'm like, he's working at family business again. (laughs) Why are they always going on trips? I don't know. The air conditioning (laughs) broke again, you know, (laughs) just like letting them put together a puzzle. It's kind of like dinner theater, you know. Oh, it's so fun. Also, we're comedian. So it's like it's just a form of riffing. Yeah. Yeah. I was at at a, a Two Oaks Lodge or something in, in Vail, and uh, these it's mob you can't get a seat. You have to wait. It's like, are you guys leaving? Like in like fifteen minutes. Like we'll wait because mm. there's no room. Mm-hmm. So we got a chair. Someone else is like, I be like I saw him. Wait, like hey, we're we're getting up. It's like it's mob here, right? I'm like, yeah, you should. Before we got here, I'm like, there was a full on fight. And the guy wow. laughed, and everyone in my group was like, there wasn't. Um, and I was like, he was like, what happened? I was like, oh, these people like pushed. Like we're here first. Then they got in each other's face and started full <laughs> fist fighting. Yeah. And all my friends were like, all right. <laughs> like, to go with it. And it was just so fun. It was like, they had to be separated. Nobody at the table. The security came in. The guy's like, what? Uh, when? I'm like, like 10 minutes before you got here, dude. Oh, I love a little lighthearted lie. Yeah. Liven up your life. Doesn't hurt anybody. Oh, it's great. Like, what's he going to believe? Two random strangers fought? It's fine. Yeah, it happens. Oh. It happens all the time. Do you ever lie about the tour? Well, sometimes, well, accidentally, because like they would give us, especially when I was doing the walking tours, yeah. they would give us so much information that I'm like, okay, I'm supposed to be giving a three hour walking tour because I would do like Midtown Manhattan architecture and I would like s- confuse people's names and it's like, you're not going to remember the, gu- the guy's name who like did the mosaic on the interior of the Chrysler no way. building. Zero chance. So I'd just be like, Bob Hutchinson, you know. It like, makes it sound more legit. Yeah, details make <laughs> Good it sound old more legit. Bob Hutchinson, but yeah, there was a lot of there was a lot of mixing up stuff like that.